and he did number. Let's see if I can do this. Two. two. <laughs> well, <laughs> you understand there. That's a that's a very bad burn. And now this is important to the story. But as we're having this discussion on burning our genitalia with spicy foods on accident, um, <laughs> behind us is our food and beverage director. Ooh, this God. guy is up at the top. He's just started. We don't know a lot about him. He's just kind of a guy that's been hanging around, hasn't really told us much. He hears the entire conversation we're having. And then he walks up and he goes, no, 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 no. I'm like, okay, this is either going to be really good or really stupid. He looks us dead in the eye and says, yeah. this is the worst burn ever. I'm like, all right, let's pay attention. And he says, one time, me and my buddies, we we went to Seattle, that's the area I'm from, and we went to this Thai food place and we ate as much spicy food as we could. We had extra chilies, oh extra oil, God. we were fucking drinking. He's like, we ate so much, it was just covered. We were burning, our lips were burning, our face was burning, it was great. He goes, I look at him and go, why is that the worst burn ever? He goes, well, I drank a lot that night and when I got home, I uh, went down on my wife. Oh, man. Oh, I feel sorry for no. her. <laughs> what happened? I swear oh, to God, I, God, from that day, I have never heard of spicy food being worked into a divorce settlement. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one, my man. That's a good one. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she was burning up. That was great. I like she got to get some clinical good. trials. That was dope. Now, we got to hear more from him, bro. All right. I need another coffee. Okay, speaking of uh, unpleasant feelings and parts you shouldn't have. So, what was that? Uh, I don't know if anyone here has been to Universal Studios. Yes, sir. Right, right. Yeah. Okay, I big so, kid, I big girls. Okay, I'm not going to say big, so but thick girls, that girls that got the thighs, you know what I mean? Thicker like a snicker. <laughs> Look. <laughs> when you got thick thighs, you have to conform your outfit to wherever you're gonna be. Okay. Yeah, you do. Yeah. So you are, you don't want to be wearing some tights walking around a whole theme park. Okay. So unfortunately, some of my luggage got lost this trip. Right? We went to Universal Studios. I had what I had to wear. Okay. I wore these tights to Universal Studio. Let's just say by the time we got to Hogwarts, mm -hmm. there was something going on no, in the Chamber me. of Secrets, tell okay? Me. There was, like, a not... It was not a good situation. Anyway. Oh. So we leave. We get home. I'm in so much discomfort, right? My husband Swampy. says, well, why don't you just use, like, some powder? Because we're going to go out later or whatever. And I'm just like, Creative powder? You know, what do you mean? Like, I've never had this problem before. So he goes, yeah, here's some powder. Just use this. Just use this. You'll feel better. Okay, go to the bathroom. Do what my what? trusted husband advises me to do. Okay. Come out. All of a sudden, I feel like I have frostbite. Oh, my gosh. In my nether region. Okay, I'm like, oh my gosh, it's burning. Like, it's burning. It's hot and cold all at the same time. What's going on here? He goes, oh. And I'm like, what do you mean? I wasn't oh. powder. No, he gave Look, you icy I, hot. Listen, when you cut something in the nether region, you don't want to hear someone say, oh, after the fact. So he gets this medicated icy hot powder. Oh, oh, oh no, he didn't. Oh, <laughs> no, he didn't. Oh, my God. Y'all. <sighs> Uh-uh. He can, yeah. I, I was wondering if me and Hub City had the same divorce lawyer. I don't know. Wow. Okay. Wow, that's crazy. So that's how long that pain last? Mm -hmm. Like We all want to know, huh? Oof. Who's next, me? Oof. No one. Woo-hoo! I could be next. All right, you can... Alright, just uh, I need to unperform. Just click. Jesus. On, I, need to perform. I had a story I totally forgot. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you want to share it? Just click perform here. Uh, okay. Uh, 
Uh, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot who's next. You about to be funny. You about to be funny. Really? Are we blind? I'm gonna go grab me another kick. Hey, buddy, can I get a kick? One of your finest pies. Uh, I am playing a uh, comedy club or something. I have a construction joke for you guys. Yeah. There you go. <coughs> Thank you, sir. That's five dollars. Tough crowd. Come here, pie. All right, what's up, Jace? What's up, what bro? What's up, Mexican in your basement? Yeah. What's up? How's it going? We call Mexican in your basement. Good, bro. Free tacos. Let's see. Free tacos? Oh, because he's locked up in your basement and he's Mexican. He likes tacos. Free tacos. I got humor. I hit the button. Boo. Be quiet, you. Boo. <laughs> oh, I'm next. All right, you're up next. Hey, hey what's up, guys? What's up? <laughs> uh, ooh, we got a lot of people uh, up in here. It's time to make you guys laugh, huh? <laughs> All right, check it out, guys. Me and my wife, right? We like to role play. Everybody does, you know? It's normal. Mm -hmm. It could be normal. Unless you uh, work a lot. So, um, I get off work early, right? And I tell my wife, you know what? Be home. I'm going to come to the door, and we're going to role play. So I'm like, coming from work, I'm wearing a, a white beef teeter, uh, a white beef, you know, one of those tank tops, you know, that make you look all tough and everything. All right? So I slam to the door. Boom! Remind me, I'm just role playing. It's not real. I kick my door right o wide open. I go to the kitchen, open up the microwave. What's this? I grabbed that by accident. <laughs> I open up the microwave. No food in the microwave. I'm like, what? bitch, where my food at? <laughs> that bitch. We, we, we're role playing. That's how she likes it. She likes that. So I'm like, bitch, where my food at? She comes down. Oh, I'm sorry, puppy. I thought I put it in the microwave, but here's a TV <laughs> dinner. A TV dinner. I don't want a damn TV dinner. So I take my belt off, right? You know what time it is now, girl. So I take my belt off. I tell her to bend over, right? Uh, I'm, what? Oh, it's my wife. She told me not to say it. <laughs> yeah, babe? Oh. All right, guys. I can't tell the story. She told me not to. It's like, I got, I got the belt, right? So I'm whipping her, right? So she's like, ah, ah. And then she said the next day, it's my turn to do... uh. The role play with you. I like cool, whatever, right? Yeah. So yeah. the next day, oh, don't worry, I I make it right to R. So the next day, uh, I'm home, and she said she called me up, babe. Guess what? It's time to role play. I'm like, yes, I'll wait. I'm on the bed. I'm like relaxing. I'm like, yeah, I wonder what's gonna be, right? So these cops comes in, and I'm like, oh, we got some cops. I get locked up in the bed, whatever, right? And she's like, no, you hit me too hard with that belt, motherfucker, you get locked up. I'm like, damn. <laughs> yeah, that role play went a little bit too far, so. That's all I got, guys. Yo, you got locked up? Yeah, man, they locked me up. Her, her role play, it, I hear a little bit too hard with the belt, so she called the cops on me. Nah, bro. Yeah. Nah, that's called role play. Long, long, bro. <laughs> all right. Nice. Wait, I got, I got to go this way? No. Was it, was it funny? Was it funny? I just did that. That's it. funny, right? Broke the eggs, like... I have a few more. The best part was when you were talking to your wife. <laughs> yeah, she's right here next to me. <laughs> she's telling me not to Oh, well, she... Eggs. I think she went upstairs. What's this, Easter? That was the best. <laughs> I actually got recorded for my YouTube. That's funny. No, you should, you should definitely work that yeah. in. Yeah. Work that's, that in. That's going to be on my YouTube jokes, channel. Man, that was pretty...